Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to my channel, DJ and Kid. So in today's video, I'm gonna be talking about Render. A lot of people have been saying right now that you shouldn't be buying Render, it's literally ran. And that is pretty much true. I mean, the project has absolutely ran. It's been on an amazing ball run in its kind of own right. And um, yeah, it's been doing really, really well. So I'm gonna be taking a look at Render, just doing a bit of a, a dive into the project and giving you my opinion and my views on if you should be buying the token still at these prices. So let's get straight into it. Okay, so Render is trading at rank 50 in terms of all crypto projects out there. Currently trading at $2.69 and market cap at the moment is roughly sitting around a billion for circulating tokens. And we can see here fully diluted valuation is 1.4 billion. So circulating supply is 366 million tokens. Total supply is 531 million tokens. Um, so pretty much still a little bit of more tokens to be released out to the ecosystem. But you could probably say that, you know, majority of them are pretty much out there now. So more than obviously more than 50 percent. So if we take a look at the all time high, eight dollars and 78 cents. Do I feel like we'll hit that eight dollars and 78 cents again? And, you know, in my honest opinion, I think we'll absolutely smash that out of the park. Come the next ball run, this could easily be one of the biggest projects out there, in my opinion. So obviously, guys, this is purely my opinion. Um, nothing that I say is financial advice. So do your own research if you do look to invest. And if we take a look at the um, the year's performance for Render so far, we've been in a bear market overall and Render is literally up 281%. So obviously, these guys are doing something right and smashing... Um, um, smashing the prices out of the park and pretty much being on a ball run in in pretty much their own um, in their own kind of space. So yeah, overall the project's performance has been absolutely amazing in the year so far. So okay, so if we take a look at the render uh, website, distributed GPU rendering on the blockchain. Not really much going on on the website to be honest. I mean it's pretty much a one pager, a bit about the team. A um, bit about how Render is actually working and so on. So as we know, Render is a distributed GPU rendering network. It's built on top of Ethereum blockchain. So the the network aims to um, aims to connect artists and studios in need of GPU compute power with mining partners willing to rent their GPU capabilities out. So it's all to do with that kind of rendering and so on. And obviously we can see here pretty much rendering the metaverse so involved with various various projects and some real big players as well so the render network aims to solve kind of um a lot of issues but these primarily can be some of the three main points so obviously from a cost speed and efficiency point of view so from a cost point of view traditional rendering services are pretty much expensive and um can be out of reach for like you know artists and studios and um, a lot of you know those kind of individuals or those areas due to how expensive um you know the, the the process can be so the render token aims to make rendering much more affordable by providing a decentralized platform where users can rent gpu power from each other so that's a, a real big plus point there from a speed point of view traditional rendering services can be slow especially when a project gets very complex but what render aims to do is speed up the rendering process by leveraging the power of a blockchain to distribute jobs across multiple nodes. So obviously that makes the, the rendering process a lot more quicker. And from an efficiency point of view, so as we know, like, you know, the traditional rendering services are often inefficient. Um, they require a lot of um, energy to power up the GPUs. So what the render project aims to do again is make the, the process much more efficient by using a proof of render system to verify that work has been completed before any payment is released. So three big, big areas there from render and obviously a massive um, pain point in the space which render is literally um, solving. So that's, that's pretty much bullish from my point of view. Again, from a partnership point of view, we know render is literally partnered with the best out there. They've continued to partner with a lot of big players more recently as well. There's been Apple, so there's been a partnership with Apple to bring Octane X to their iPhones and iPads and also with Microsoft as well to bring out the Azure project. So, um, yeah, massive, massive partnerships there and many, many more as well. So overall, 
really bullish bullish from a um, partnership point of view. And I guess more recently in the news, um, there's been the the kind of hype around Nvidia absolutely blowing their performances out of the roof. And you know, there's been a lot of news about Nvidia. So what they've also talked about is um, is exploring the potential of using blockchain technology to improve efficiency of GPU rendering. So with that news, obviously render absolutely was exploding because render is like the first um, area or the first blockchain project that any, you know, real big reputable organization looking at, you know, using blockchain to render will come to. So yeah, that, that's mega bullish for render as well. And off the back end of that news, um, render token did pretty much pump. So yeah, guys, obviously take a look at the website. I've just given you a bit of insight there about some of the things going on with render. Take a look at the website, have a look at the team, have a look at the process, how this actually works and see if this project is for you. But overall, from my point of view, you know, like I said, guys, I'm mega bullish on render. If we take a look at the Twitter here, we can see a lot of um, a lot of news, a lot of tweets. And yeah, these guys are literally getting partnerships like pretty much consistently. And that is obviously very bullish. So yeah, just take a look at the Twitter as well. You can see a lot of news, a lot of um, hype around what um, the project is actually doing and how they are achieving as well. So overall, mega, mega bullish. You can see also see some of the rendering work as well that's been kind of carried out and it looks absolutely amazing. So from a, a pricing point of view, from a graph point of view, this is kind of the, the shorter term. So I'm looking at render um, against the um, Tether US. And we can see here on the four hourly, we're pretty much in an uptrend. Um, level of resistance is roughly at $2.90 or $2.95. We're pretty much just trailing up this um, this trend line here. So you can see that's the kind of the support trend line. And we've hit that level and we start bouncing back up again. So potentially we could easily go back up to that $2.95 again. If I just pull in the um, EMAs here, we can see the 50 EMA is trading above the 200 EMA, which represents that there was a golden cross. Is also we can see that the price is um, is pretty much trending or trading above the um, 50 EMA, pretty much using that as a level of um, a level of support. And also on the RSI, we've got a um, a crossover at the bottom just there as well, which kind of indicates that the price will um, potentially move to the upside in the short term. Uh, maybe retrace again and then continue on to the upside. Pro so probably play this kind of pattern out here. So up, down, and then just, you know, break out from there. That's pretty much my shorter term price prediction. Do I believe we'll hit that $3 mark? Yeah, pretty much will. So um, yeah, shorter term, you know, we'll be hitting that $3 mark um, pretty easily. Longer term, you know, I kind of see render at a 20 billion uh, market cap potentially. So if we pull in the um, pull in the calculator here, so if we were to hit 20 billion in terms of market cap, so let's just bang bang that into here. So 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And let's divide that by the number of tokens. So obviously this is currently circulating. Um, there may be more tokens released in the ecosystem when we do hit that 20 billion. But you know, even still, it's a lot of X's on um, on current prices. So 20 billion uh, market cap divided by let's say 366 385 484 and let's just put that in so price potential at a 20 billion market cap at the same circulating supply is 54 dollars and you know honestly guys I, I potentially feel like we'll be hitting 54 dollars and we could even we could even scrape past that as well we could even continue on to the upside and get higher than that. You know, longer term, we probably easily will get higher than that. But for the next bull run, 55, $54, and potentially even higher than that as well, is a pretty sound prediction, you know, from my point of view, I believe. So yeah, guys, amazing project from my point of view. Um, obviously do your own research as well. If you do look to invest, hit me up on the comments below. Let me know what you think about the render project and um, hit that like, hit that subscribe, and I will catch you in the next video. Peace out.